Early game. Early game. Beep, beep. So guys, welcome back to Daily Apocalypse. In the last episode we had a little fight with one of the tribes on my server. The tribe threatened me um, that he would raid me, so I destroyed half of his turrets in 20 minutes. But now he kinda refused to come attack my base in return. That sounded different in the last episode, I hope you remember. If you're still enjoying Daily Apocalypse, by the way, hit that like button, comment down below. I want to keep the daily uploads up until Scorched Earth in like 7 days or so, so hope you're hyped for that. And now, let's get right into the video. Come on. It's a gauntlet's PP. It's a really good gauntlet's PP. Oh shoot. I need to get it. <laughs> no, they will catch me. Bofu jump! Now I might have the chance to get it. Bofu jump! Where's the eels? I don't know. Where's the eels? Are they already back? They're already back at the thing. They're already back at their destination. Maybe they're confused. Maybe they're confused for a second. Maybe they're confused. Give me this thing. Have it. Run! Run! Oh no 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 no! Run! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh everything is echoing! That's the end boss! That's the end boss! Oh my god, it was! I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Uh. What? No, oh, no. <laughs> but I can get it. Oh god. Oh god. I mean, this is bad, but this? Holy shit, that's really good. That was actually my first encounter with the Alpha Tribe. They were living in Lava Cave, they even had a little bit of tech and they just figured out that I was living on their server with a kinda big outside base. To some aggro, maybe? Not looting that. That's probably the message behind it. Oh, the sharks could be a problem. Well, oh, yeah, that's all a big problem. I might be dead here. Dude, this is a huge, huge problem. Holy. No way. Dude, there's a base. <laughs> there's a f base. I'm still getting hit. Dude, why? I'm not winning this. This is so fucking brain dead. Dude, this is...
this is an easy ref drain. Yeah, they cut my only Bessalo. Hmm. Big fail. Hopefully I place it on my raft. <laughs> That's why I'm driving a little bit further away. So I initially wanted to visit the Kanu Pearl Cave tribe again in in their Pearl Cave after they yeah kind of declared war on me in the last episode, but I didn't see the Acro Sharks. I only thought they had an Acro Tuzo out, so we lost our only Basilo. This base right here seems like their farming outpost, so let's raid it really quick for some compensation. Arx art. It's two C four. Um no. thought I would get shot, to be honest. No, I didn't. Ah, no, that was the uh, generator. All offline. Hopefully they have Thames here. We, that would be a big W. Well, oh, they have one turn here. Hmm. Wood, crazy. Dude, that's the guy. Is my kid? He's my kid. I could cage him and then raid his other base. I want the turret ammo. Some for sure. Or am I getting rid of all the plants? I don't really have to, right? Just need to land. Oh, not even pink on it. That's a good amount of ammo. Really nice that he wasted it. Oh, they, they, he's helping me with the... Yo, that's a really good amount of ammo. Really nice that you wasted that on the on the base. Dude, what is this? I lost all the turrets. No way, I'm still not wiped. Dude. How is it even possible? Like, the Alpha scouted me. This one guy is mad on me anyway. How is that even possible, man? Oh. Oh my god. I don't know how I'm able to survive that shit. This is. Graded? Oh man! Graded? Aber steht noch ein Vogel drin? Oder einfach out of power? Hä? That looking hella weird. Hella <laughs> hella weird. Lille 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 looking hella weird. Don't tell me it just ran out of power. No, it's not powered. It's not powered. It's not powered. Dude, what? Oh yeah, you can't, true. <gasps> no f way. Dude, that's such a nice donation. Oh. 
What? What? What does the plan situation say? Okay. It's here. Dude, this is the donation. What the f man? I need to take every. I need to check every turret. That wouldn't even be that easy to raid, as there's nothing fitting into this. Okay, wait, those are empty? Or did I take all them already? No, I didn't. So weird. He did he quit or what? No f way. No fucking way. No one found this. Oh my god! How big can you build something? I don't understand this. Not ran out for more than one day. And hey, where's the loot? Oh my god, probably here. No f way. Oh my god, that's a good RG. Dude, there is no f That's a bad Sego. Dude, there's no f way. There's no f way no one scouted this spell cave since, like. Uh, it actually ran out of power. So I noticed that myself a lot and also in other YouTubers Arcbox series, Pearl Caves are not getting attacked or scouted that often in Arc in general. And especially on Arcbox there's tribes playing the first few days and then like on most unofficials actually, they are just quitting once it's getting too much into mid or late game. In this Arcbox run I found three offline Pearl Caves but I'm only showing you this one as it's the biggest and thickest by far. The others were kinda empty but that shows me again that there's not really a lot of uh, players that are Properly scouting for targets, and now let's get back into the footage. Okay, hype to see what's inside the vaults. Two vaults. That's just bullshit. That's just a bullshit, but it should be one more. Okay. Dude, this is insane. Try of human two. I think I've seen this guy talking Clover. What's that? Okay, they are destroyed. Two bags. Okay. Kiga's that'll be P. Boah, what the fuck? Okay, okay, okay. Paste. And I'm overweight. Lo wait, I, I took saddles, right? Don't need that. I don't know. Diaper. Mingalo. Mosa. Yeah, fuck it. I don't know. We'll never get a Mosa. I even take the fertilizer. Okay, 84. Oh my god! I need the helmet BP though. I I'm taking those. I'm taking those though. Okay, I got my C4 back. Another one. Dude. There was a crazy donation. Like, what the f. Main or oh main? That was a donation. No one scouted that. That's why scouting is the key. What the f Now we were heading over to a high pop server um, for some scouting and some PvP. Let's get into it. Other guy? Yeah, I can take the other guy. Mm-hmm. 
Glück, der ist ein Alpharex. Glück, der ist ein Alpharex. Both dead. Mm, no, I, I have to get rid of the Alpharex. <laughs> Man's farming? What? There's a player. Yo, this server is cool. Two box. I bet. I bet they don't have parachutes. Oh, he has. Oh. Bye. Bye. Oh, he has even has bolas. What a dude! That was close. That was kinda close. Still overweight. Nah, this shit isn't it. Where's the guy? <laughs> what?! Oh man. Got him, but that was kind of close. I killed him with C-spin. Hmm. Terra OP. <gasps> That's cool. Plants everywhere. Tribe of Rumpel. Dude, what? There's a cryo fridge on this fucking stone base? Is that a fob? Hey, what is going on here? No. Hey! I'm blowing into that. I I'm absolutely blowing into that. What? I'm just sitting on that side. Dude, it's one, two, three guys. They're literally sitting in their normal turret base instead of sitting in their like main base. I will be landing there, this mount, so the turret's shooting the PT, I will take all the turrets, then I will go to the side where the turret is, uh, like, not covering it anymore, and then I will hopefully be able to blow inside. <laughs> Imagine I wouldn't have uh, dropped the shield. Earlier. Yeah, let's just try it. It's one for normal, right? though dude it's not dude it's not offline 
We going home. We going home, boys. We can't always, like, uh, succeed these suicide runs without proper flag and shit. It was kind of dumb, but it's an arc poke, so... I mean, if the if the PT wouldn't have blocked me that badly, I might... Might have had a chance to take all the turret as planned, but... Like, it blocked me, I punched it once, and then I lost my leggings already, so... I'm out of uh, stamina, right? Yeah. When forever finally ends, all the promises are broken. No more fights to pick up the pieces. I left you with the parts of me. I don't want to see you again. Don't want to write any more of our stories. When love is in the mouth, you have to move on Just to be numb, you know all the rules there No, it's not right, no, it's not right I sleep better at night When love is in the mouth So after some primitive PvP on other servers, let's get back into the main plot. On my server next to Kano Pearl Cave and the Alpha Tribe sitting in Lava Cave, there was a pretty aggressive Asian tribe living in an unraidable rat hole underneath of one of the Pearl Caves. Many smaller or medium sized tribes on the server got raided by them. I even got warned that they are here to raid everyone and I saw one of their players looting small ice cave loot crates. I actually just wanted to do the same. Um, I have a bed nearby, that's why I'm naked. I personally would love to get fought by these Asian, uh, aggressive Asian tribe as well. So uh, let's mess with them a little bit. Let's get into the footage. Super loud, fuck. They are rocking Prim flag. Oh, I can finally raid Pearl Caves again, man. There's so many juicy Pearl Cave bases that I can't raid because I didn't find a single high level Basilo. That's not even good, but I fing don't care. Come here. Come on, come on, come here. I'm pretty sure this generator ran out of ammo, um, of gas, uh, like of g out of gas, and that's why these turrets are offline. Not sure though. And from what I've seen, th there's turrets, but they are not shooting. The only two turrets are shooting um, are those two here. <coughs> So let's see what we can do. <clears throat> so that's the so-called aggressive Asian tribe that is raiding everyone. And actually, they just raided a pretty big, uh, medium-sized, I don't know, tribe at Green Obelisk. I've seen their fob there and the raided base next to it. That means uh, these guys are active. I just see four trip one of the members at uh, the small ice cave, you have seen it. But as you can see, two of their ceiling turrets are offline. That means one of their generator ran out of gas. At this point, I didn't even know that they were living in a rat hole underneath this pearl cave and that what you can see here is nowhere near their main base. 
but the one offline generator will be much more important than I initially thought, but for now, let's get back into the raid. Okay. I think this other tier, this line of sight, it's pretty <laughs> fucking badly. <coughs> Might use a rocket or try a rocket. This Giga is the problem though. Use an echo. Come on, Giger. Now the Giger's behind the corner. I mean, sooner or later it will rage. <laughs> Any second now, hopefully. I mean, how bloody, uh, how more bloody it can be. Dude. That was literally bullshit. That took like a million t years. I need to deal with the one last heavy that's shooting. Ah, oh, this shooting, okay. But it's line of sighted like crazy. I think there's no other way but pop beer, pop that and go. Because my flag is too scuffed. Like, oh my god. <coughs> there's no other way. Okay. Dude, that's not a lot of ammo. Wreckage. Where's the other turrets? Uh, I have no idea. Where's the other gen? Where's the other turrets? <laughs> okay. Huh? It's offline. Oh huh? no no, it's not offline. Where's the gen? It's not here. Is it actually just in that box? Is it just a one in the box? Hey, it's not running. That was not the gen. Must be underneath. Like, where's the gen? But I hear it, I think. It's hard to tell with this fabricator noises. Your yeah, one bolt is gone. Come on, give me four. Ah. Very useful. Not. How's that not? Okay, some profit. Yes, sir, some explosives. Where's the cryos, though? Come on, C4, come on, come on. Oh, yeah, can blow the vaults with that. Look at the crapples, though. Like, they were prepared for some defenses. But no fucking C4. Finally, man. Come on. Wow. There's obviously the resources vault. Oh, 
turtle eggs. Whole other narcotic. Where are these turtles? Oh, th this wall is not even wrinkled. No C4, like none. <coughs> Could have crafted something. No. Oh, can you like fuck off? We still have rockets. No. What the fuck is that? That's. Oh, that's underneath. Oh, now I know. They have the fucking rat hole. Oh yeah, it's a fucking rat hole underneath. Oh my god, now I got it. They probably have all their cryos and all the shit in the rat hole underneath. I don't know if I can enter it though. I mean, I bring the loot to my fob and to the RG and then I'm coming back and try to get into the red hole, I think. That's what we're we doing. Oh man, that would be a long ride. I've heard that some people get death wild out of this red hole. I mean, it's underneath a pearl cave, so... Obviously it might be... Illegal. Probably depending on who's who's um, answering the tickets. I don't know where where the fucking retro entrance is at though. Fuck man, that's bad. That's really bad. Was it here? Yeah, it's here. Okay. Let's check. Diplo Carlos. Yeah, look at this shit, man. I've heard you can crapple through as well, absolutely. Bullshit. Bullshit, man, you can't crapple through. You need a fucking diplocaulos. Dude, absolute bullshit, you can't crapple through. Doesn't matter, let's just see if we can get past. We can, we can, we can. Yeah, the turret is not powered. We'll just leave it here. I don't know which direction now. Dude, it's so stupid. Literally so stupid. One wasn't even filled. Is there something above? Huh, only bullshit though. I mean, I don't know where I can go and where I will get anti meshed. Oh, the, this is probably the main loot stash. I can already tell. Yep! Tuzo! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, man! A good Tyler? Two good Tyler? Dude, this is insane. This is insane, insane. No fucking way. No fucking way, dude. Look at this f***ing rattle, man. Oh my god, the carbo zettles. Yo! The zettles, though. Well, it's just the water again. Man, this is like cave diving. It's f***ing... Scary.
Dude, this red hole is unraidable if you, like, power your turrets. I don't know what they were smoking. What were they smoking? Even if they would have powered the two heavies, like, right before the entrance, I w my Diplo would have been shot. I probably would have died. Insane. Oh, man. Please, helmet VP. No, there's no... That's no helmet PP. Good lagging stuff. So. Oh, it's good. Like, how how are you living in an unraidable red hole? You're living in an unraidable red hole, but you're not powering your turrets? Why though? Why? I don't understand this. Like, literally no idea. No idea why anyone would do that. So what I didn't figure out at that time, but what I noticed after rewatching my recordings um, while editing the video, was that a normal generator inside of the red hole is not reaching and therefore not powering the red hole entrance. That's why they had a second generator inside of their pearl cave that was powering the red hole and a generator in the red hole that was powering the pearl cave above. Bad luck for them that their most important generator ran out of power while they were offline for I think three hours when I started the raid. This red hole was absolutely unraidable at that time. It was considered illegal to build and nowadays, if you are wondering, it's completely patched by a wildcard. The entrance is closed, but at the time, like I said, it was unraidable if you're not completely stupid. Dude, I have literally no storages. Literally, man. So many grapples, I don't care. <laughs> literally, like, a thousand. And right after that I wanted to scout the alpha of my server, actually didn't scout them for a while now in their um, lava cave base. I remember that they have an outside tower, so let's see what they are capable of. Hopefully we can get some online PvP, if not we might start soaking them. I um, have my quets and a stagger with me. I have everything on me basically. We will see us tomorrow for that. Hope you are still enjoying daily uh, videos. It's a lot of work, but it's also fun to edit the videos. Thank you guys for watching and we see us tomorrow. Goodbye.